This current challenge is called printing tokens. We're going to receive a sentence and we have to tokenize that sentence and then print every word on its own line. An example is what you see here. This is C. We need to grab that sentence, split it into words and print it like this. So this on its own line is on its own line and then C also on its own line. And this is a second example. So in C++, in the past, you've seen me use something like I string stream and we can create an object like this, provided that we've added this SS stream header at the top. And let's say we have a sentence like this here. I could pass that sentence to an I string stream instance. In this case, I'm calling it SS and I'm passing it my sentence. And then I could have some sort of intermediary string that I'm calling reader. And inside of a while loop, I can use the uh, get line function and the get line function can support three arguments. So the first one would be the SS object, the I string stream object. The second one would be the intermediary string into which we're going to store every token. And this here would be the delimiter, this third arguments. So in this case, this one here is space, meaning that we intend to read that sentence word by word. So anytime we encounter a space, we stop, we grab what we've read so far as a token, and then we store that inside our reader. So we could use C out and then print every word from this reader variable at every iteration. So what you see here, that sentence, please subscribe to my channel, becomes this here, what I'm trying to highlight inside the black section of my screen. But this was C++. In this challenge, we have to use C language. So in C, we can use the function SCR talk. And I think this stands for string token. So we're also going to use a delimiter because we're going to pass two arguments. The first one is going to be our string and the second one is going to be the delimiter. We are also going to use a while loop like what they are showing us here. This is an example. Let's say this is our sentence. And then here we have a character pointer, which can be used to point to the first position inside of a character array. They are using that pointer to grab the value returned by this str talk function. We are using any of these as delimiters, that is a space, a comma, a period, and a hyphen. So this function is going to read the sentence up until it meets any of these delimiters, and it's going to grab what is read so far and make it available as a token, which we can then access through this pointer right here. So the only thing that really changes is the way we need to continue reading the tokens, because at the next iteration, this function expects a null pointer. And the reason why that is so is because it's going to use the last position from the last token that it read as the starting position in that new iteration. So it's going to keep extracting tokens and then eventually it's going to become null. So this while loop is going to exit. This is the same thing that I'm doing here in this challenge. First, I think they give us these lines of code, but then you have to write this yourself. So what they provide us is a char pointer and then they use the malloc function to reserve space for a long sentence, 1024 characters. And then here they use the scanf function to read a full string until the new line character is found. And then here they use the realloc function so that we only consume the space that we need. And then here below is the start of my solution. So I'm having a character pointer, a char pointer that I'm calling token, and I'm using the scr talk function. This here, my first argument is the sentence. The char pointer here pointing to the first position inside of a character array, which is the sentence. And then this here is my delimiter. So my delimiter here is a space. And instead of this while loop, I'm saying, so long as the token is not null, meaning that we can still go ahead and extract tokens from our sentence, I want to print the first token that I have, which is this one right here, the first token. So I want to print this one first. And then I want to extract the next token from my sentence. So like I said, the SCR talk function expects a null pointer at the next iteration. So I'm passing null here, and then I'm still passing my delimiter because I want to keep extracting tokens word by word. And I'm storing that inside of my char pointer called token. At the next iteration, I'm going to check again, is token null? If it's not, I'm going to go ahead, print the value here, and then keep extracting until I no longer have any token to extract. So let's go ahead and submit this code right away. We've just passed all the test cases. So that's it for this current challenge. It was called printing tokens. If you liked my solution, please subscribe to my channel, turn on your notifications, and I'll catch you next time.